This is a tuxedo cat, and this is not a tuxedo cat. But why is that, since both cats have the same two colors? I'll explain in just a bit. So stay with us to find out, as this video is all about the very popular tuxedo cats. But first, let's see why tuxedo cats are so popular. Well, everything started in Egypt, where cats were gods and humans worshipped them. Several ancient Egyptian deities were depicted and sculptured with cat-like heads and cats were frequently portrayed in royal times and hieroglyphics. But the best part? About 70% of these cats were actually tuxedo cats. As time moved on, the popularity of taxis remained high, with a number of famous people having one. Shakespeare, Beethoven, Sir Isaac Newton shared the house with the tuxedo cat. It seems that smart people tend to be drawn to them. They were even portrayed on television. Some popular tuxedo stars are Sylvester from Looney Tunes, Felix the Cat, Figaro from Pinocchio, and the Cat in the Head from Dr. Seuss. These are the most famous ones, but I'm sure there are more famous tuxedo cats out there, so feel free to tell me in the comments if you know any of them. But as I said in the beginning of the video, not all black and white cats are actually tuxedo. Now let's see why. Well, the difference between these two gorgeous kitties is the amount of white that can be found in their fur. Tuxedo cats have the genes to be black, but also have a white spotting gene. This gene is responsible for masking the black color on some parts of the body. The spotting gene produces different grades of white spotting, from 1 to 10. Tuxedo cats fall into the low grades, from 1 to 4. The lower the number, the less white is seen. Also, cats are generally considered a tuxedo if their coats resemble one. The body should be black, while the chest, paws, neck and even a part of their face is white. But is there actually a reason for the amount of white a cat has? In order to find out, let's dive into the beautiful cat color genetics. There is a genetic difference between low amounts of white and high amounts of white. Those kitties with less white have actually inherited just a copy of this white spotting gene. As a result, the amount of white in these cats is usually 40% or less. On the other hand, the beautiful kitties with large amount of white have inherited two copies of this gene, which makes them not qualified to be a true tuxedo. Of course, you can still call your white and black cat a tuxedo if you want to, nobody will blame you for that. But tuxedo cats do not come in just black and white. Because the term tuxedo isn't strictly defined, orange and white or grey and white cats could also be qualified as a tuxedo, providing their pattern looks like one. And no, taxis are not a breed, as this color combination can be found in many breeds. They can be Maine Coons, Turkish Angora or American or British Horsehair, so health and lifespan are related to every breed. Their personalities also vary, but in general, most owners say taxis are playful, intelligent and quite vocal. So now that we know what tuxedos are, let's see why they're considered special. Taxis might just have magical powers, because they can become invisible in the vernal or diurnal equinox. Besides this, a lot of tuxedo cat owners swear these kitties are much smarter than other cats. Hmm, I bet they can do this. Ha, in your face. We even went on Reddit to find out if taxis are really smarter than other cats, but it seems that opinions on this topic are divided. It's also said that tuxedo cats open their eyes a whole 24 hours before any other cat. But nevertheless, tuxedo cats seem to be on their way to conquer the world. Only one cat has ever made it to the top of Mount Everest and, you guessed it, he was a tuxedo cat. But that's not all. In 1998, a tuxedo cat named Sparky inherited a whopping 6.3 million dollars. And the tuxedo cat even made it into the White House. President Bill Clinton had one taxi during his service. So, what did we learn about tuxedo cats? Well, they're very popular with a bright history. Some people say they're the most intelligent cats in the world. Sika proved that competition is high on this. And, last but not least, they achieve some really amazing things. What's next for tuxedo cats? Hmm, who knows, maybe Mars. But for you, since you made it so far, it can be our video with names for your black and white cat or why not our other video. And check our links in the description for some really cool stuff for your cat.